And now, your feature presentation. Alright. That feature presentation, boys and girls, is on night 106 of Saturday Night Reception. And I am your host, Ben S7 1287, along with Aubrey and Mikey. You know the boss. <laughs> oh. And we also picked up NWB 1989. Oh, I do apologize for that. Uh, oh, hey. That's okay, man. I don't know what's with the comment there on the pro on the comment section below there. So, no hard feelings to that. That's okay. That's okay. Then why don't? Of course, I do have an anonymous person trying to call me. I don't even know who he is anyway, so I just ignore him. Yeah, I got one too, and I ignore him as well. And welcome, Milady, to the St. Patrick's Day night. No, it's the eve of St. Patrick's Day. Of course, we're going to do our favorite game of the whole world, Waddies. No, that's God is. I mean, Waddies. Why don't you get my Blarney Stone? Why don't you get my Blarney Stone? Shh. Has an hour. Yeah. Where do you work? I'm working out of the damn boss. My own damn boss. Where do you work? And as an hour is brought to you by... Was also brought to you by 98.3 The Key, Retro 92.1, Sunny 106.5, Cool 105.5. In Big Bob Country, your new home for NASCAR in the Tri-State area. And it's brought to you by a wee bit of a shamrock from McDonald's. And also brought to you by... Also brought to you by the Food City 500 on Fox at 1 o'clock today. And it's Bristol tomorrow. Ooh, yeah, yeah, Bristol, baby. Bristol Motor Speedway, where tempers are going to happen. Oh, yeah. We know what's going to happen yeah. next. <laughs> Alright, and we're uh, going... by Mikey's gonna get his butt whooped sooner or later. And we're going to do our next game uh, one of Jeopardy I'm Johnny for the PC. We'll to our game in a minute, but we just have a little business to take care of. Normal game. Huh? Bazoo! Oh, oh, ow, ow, ow! What's your name? Ow! Larry Long has the score. Oh, we need to make for that one. Alright, here we go! Oh. 
Whoopsie. Thanks, Johnny. My manners. And welcome to when Mike, you know, in the. No, they're in Mikey's butt. All right, let's get to the first round categories. Here we go. Pen names. Pen names. Modern, Modern history. history. A plus. A plus. A for taste mark. You know that. Opryland, Opry USA. USA. Films of the 70s. Films of the 70s. And World Capitals. This is my password. All right, player one, that, start us off. They're on the leprechaun's pot of gold. A wee bit of a pot of gold. A plus 400. Some biologists classify the blue-green types of these simple organisms oh, um, as bacteria. <laughs> Amoeba. M-O-E-B-A. Okay. That is incorrect. Really? What is algae? Correct. Oh, algae. It's your turn, player two. It precedes male, sick, and mattress. Player one. Yes. And I am drinking Dr. Pepper. Sorry for you guys on this. A plus for three. A city in southeast Texas or a famous chipmunk. I get it. Alvin! That's right. <laughs> oh, I just love to do that. 400. It's that an automaton oh. that resembles a human being. Oh. Player one. Five hundred A plus. The left-handed dictionary defines this as a man you can shut up by closing a book. Player one. That's right. Let's go film some seventies for a hundred. At the beginning of this film, George C. Stott addresses his troops in front of a huge American flag. Player one. You are correct. Fails at the 70 for two. All right, player one. Peggy Sue, That'll Be the Day, and other songs in this 1978 film were sung by its star, Gary Busey. Player one. Yes, indeed. All right, 300. Whoops. The Bulgarian city, now called this, was once known as Sredets. Player three. What is Varna? No. Too bad. Player one. Correct. Okay. I was supposed to go with film something similar for three, and I have all capitals for three. But we still got it right. This 1979 nuclear disaster film, starring Jane Fonda and Michael Douglas, had no background music. Player one. We got... Who messaged me? Who was it? You was it. Oh. Sis, Oh, okay. All right, let's go. Films at the 70 for four. The world's tallest building, the Glass Tower in San Francisco, is the setting for this 1974 disaster film. Player one. Correct. 500. In a 1976 remake, 
This tidal beast plummets to his death from atop the World Trade Center. Player one? Yes. Well, Capitals, Player one, it's your turn. This Dutch city stock exchange, one of the world's oldest, was founded around 1608. Player one? Correct. Well, Capitals for two. And so, you will double player one. Please make your wager. Say what? What the fuck? Right up. At the farm. The wife. I'll bet the wife on this one. El Capitolio, the capital building in this Venezuelan city, is noted for its beautiful gilded dome. Correct. Thank you. World Capitals for four. The United Nations Economic Commission for Africa is headquartered in this Ethiopian city. Player one? And, oh, yeah. No, that's incorrect. I, Player two? Oh. What is Addis Ababa? I yes. found it with a D. This Lolita author wrote nine Russian novels under the name The Siren. Um. Player three? Was Who is Vladimir Nabokov? That's correct. While a student, this Andromeda Strain author used the pen names John Lang and Jeffrey Hudson. Who Player was? Two. Who is Michael Crichton? Yes. Who? Player two, your turn. William right. Sidney Porter wrote The Ransom of Red Chief under this pen name. Come back. All right. Three. Who is O. Henry? Oh. His early work appears in an obscure yeah, Armenian that. language publication under the name Sirak Gorian. Who was, um... Player three. Shoot. Who is William Saroyan? Ah! Uh, yes. He wrote The Big Needle as Simon Miles and Eye of the Needle as himself. Player Robert three. Frost? Who is Ken Follett? Why, yes. Soon yeah. after taking office in 1981, this president lifted the grain embargo on the Soviet Union. Um, player one? Right. The actor? Capitals for five. The childhood home of New Zealand writer Catherine Mansfield is an attraction in this capital city. New Zealand, uh. Player one? Oh, yeah, Wellington. <laughs> Correct. A plus. Return, player one. A plus two. In October 1957, she became the first British monarch to open Canada's parliament. Ah. Uh, player one. Who is, um. Uh, uh, Margaret Thatcher. That's wrong. What? Uh, what? It's not Margaret Thatcher. Who is Princess Anne? No. We've been Elizabeth the second. Player two? Who is Elizabeth the second? Correct. Ah. Uh, With its theme been a park guess. and mega hotel, Hello. Opryland is one of this state's most popular... Tennessee! Player one? Yes. Come on, Opryland, Tennessee. Their giveaway. The Unread Modern History. In 1985, researchers from Woods Hole Oceanographic Institute located the wreckage of this liner. Player three. What is the Titanic? 
Correct. Damn you, woman! Visitors can go rolling on the river aboard a showboat named for this general and seventh president. Player one? Seventh president. Um. Andrew. Oh. Yeah. That's right. Hmm. Check comic section. You had somebody who's being an ass. Alright. In 1928, Ataturk removed the constitutional provision that named this turkey's state religion. Player two? What is? What is Islam? Correct. What will it be, player two? In 1965, President Johnson sent 20,000 U.S. troops to this country, Haiti's neighbor. Player one? That's it. I'll be left for three. In 1994, George Lindsay and Ganella Hutton shared center stage once again in a salute to this series. Player one? Yeehaw! Yes! <laughs> now that was one in the 50s. Adjacent to the park are three museums, one of which honors this late queen of country comedy. Player Dolly two? Parton? Who is Minnie Pearl? Ah. Correct. An historic building, this former home of the Grand Ole Opry, was renovated and reopened in 1994. Um, shoot. No, I'm not going to ring in. I'm going to let it go. Here is the correct response. Wyman Auditorium. All right, that's the end of the Jeopardy round. Ew, that was a good round. Yep. All right, double players, get Jeopardy. ready for Double Jeopardy. We're going to look at the categories. Now, here are the categories for then the we're going to take Jeopardy a quick round. break. The 1550s. 1550s. Washington, Washington State. Oh! In the kitchen. Oh! Three letter words. Gone to the dogs. And here's the final category. I wish I'd said that. <laughs> yeah, I wish I would say that. Player three. Uh oh, here we go. Six hundred five foot Seattle landmark. Turn at one. Space needle. Player one. That's it. All right, we're gonna take a quick break. We'll be right back.